Gabby Kime, Purple Belt, here at 10th Planet Springfield. We're working on V3 in the 10th uh, Planet warm up series. We're going to start up on our feet. So we're going to start up on our feet in a wrestling position. Gabby's going to shoot a double leg. I'm going to hit it with a good sprawl. My hips go in. Uh, my leg is going to go flat to the mat. Once I've stopped her progression, I'm going to wrap up her arm and her neck. And I'm going to start to move forward, pulling her up. Now at this point, I'm going to release my grip as I start to slide back and get to my Marcelotine grip. And I'm going to grab my wrist right over the top. My thumb stays connected to my hand, and I want to pinch my elbows together. My left uh, forearm should go right over the top of her shoulder here. Here, right over the top of the shoulder. My right foot is going to slide underneath of me as a kind of baseball slide. Here, and like I said, I'm going to pinch my elbows together and pull up against the neck for the tap. Rewind back to an arm in. She defends her neck by grabbing my wrist. My left leg is going to come in for a butterfly hook. I'm going to sweep her right over the top of her left arm and follow her in the mouth. From here, I'm going to release that grip again, reestablish by sliding my hand right up against her neck to grab my own wrist again. My elbows pinch to the floor, my hips drop down, and I pull up to get the tap. From here, she's going to hip bump up to shin guard. I'm in the knee pummel. My knee rotates inward as my heel goes towards my butt. And I get back into like a headquarters position. I'm going to slide into the DMs. Okay. When I slide into the DMs, I'm pinning her leg down and I'm going to start to work to get her wrist to the mat. From here, I'm hunting for the neck. So I'm going to start to roll over the top and this arm's going to go over her neck and I'm going to Superman or not Superman, but I'm going to roll over the top. I got to the DMs, I get the wrist, I pin it down, and now I'm going to look to roll right over the top and get to a chin strap with my right hand. Catching her elbow with my left hand, my legs never hit the mat. I tighten up my, my core, bring my legs up over the top, and again finish a Marcelotine. From here, her hands go to my hips, she bumps her hips up, she's coming through. I stand up and she's going to Imanari, her right arm goes inside my left leg as she pulls herself all the way around, creating honey hole here. As she starts to come around and sweeps, she's gonna step to her own foot, inside heel hook, exposure, getting her grip together to a tap. From there, I'm gonna open the knees, plant my hand and lift my hips up. When my hips come up, I'm going to shut the knees, turn, and sit on her hip. From here, my knee is popped out, so my leg is no longer in danger of her attacking. My right hand will start to come in front of her chest, looking for her neck on the far side. This way here, as I come around the corner, I grab a seatbelt. My left knee goes tight to her back, and my right leg, big step. As I sit and lean, I'm going to throw a body triangle on the top side. My left arm is going to go underneath of the neck. My right hand pulls out, and I'm going to go into a palm-to-palm -palm grip, and I'm going to go almost belly down as I apply hip pressure forward and squeeze the neck for the dance seven jump. One more time from the top.
Alright guys, that's B3. Check out B4 next. <laughs>